Hello guys and welcome to the Everyday Unboxer. In today's video, we are going to have a look at the Eken or Eken 3-axis gimbal. It is a Chinese gimbal that I bought from AliExpress. It was £30. I'm sure that if you look for it in the American AliExpress, it's going to be around the same price, $30, $40. And for the price, it's a really good value. I have been working my way around it for the last week and for sure there is a learning curve that you have to go through but in no time you will be taking great footage with this gimbal. It's a really simple thing to use although like I say it has a learning curve that you have to go through but once you get the hang of it and I still haven't got to where I want to recording with this gimbal but I've improved. At the end, I will be showing you footage that I've um, took with this gimbal. I applied some effects, some color corrections, stuff like that. It's gonna look amazing. So this is the gimbal. It comes with a micro USB charging cable. It takes, um, it charges pretty fast. It doesn't take too long. And um, here it is. It's really simple. Thing. All you have to do is just put your phone in, balance it, and that's it. So how to do this is very simple. All you have to do is just install your phone in the gimbal. What I like to do, you can use any smartphone. It doesn't have to be an iPhone. But in the iPhone, it has the home button line at the bottom of the screen. So what I like to do is I try to align the bottom, the, the button of like the line the best that I can with the bottom of the gimbal so that it's like centered as much as possible. Then what you have to do is you have to put it on a flat surface. You cannot um, balance the gimbal if it's not on a flat surface. So you have to do it on a flat surface. So once it's best centered as possible, you put it on a flat surface and it has a knob. As you can see, it's not balanced. It keeps falling to a side. So there's a knob there that you have to untight and then you have to pull the weights that it has on the right side so you can get the balance to be as straight as possible as you see i adjusted it only once and it looks pretty good but i fiddled around with it until i got the best balance that i could get and then what you have to do it's test it out so you have to balance it like that to see that it's not well balanced because if it's not balanced properly what you're going to do is you're going to burn the motors that the gimbal has and that's not going to be good for the gimbal so once you adjust it you just tighten the knob again once you tighten the knob it's done your gimbal it's ready to be used just check that it's balanced properly so all you have to do is Press the button for three seconds and the gimbal will turn on. And that's it. You're ready to record amazing footage with your brand new gimbal. The middle mode is half follow and the bottom mode it's complete follow. So if it's on the bottom, if I move right to left, it will follow. If I move it up and down, it will follow as well. If it's on the middle, if you move up and down, it won't follow you. But if you move right and left, it will follow you. And if it's on the top mode, it doesn't matter where you move. It won't follow you anywhere. It'll just stay right there. So the next thing that you should do is always lock your um, focus and exposure. So here I'm going to show you some footage that I recorded using this gimbal. I just applied some effects some um, music and color correction and this is what i came up with i hope you like it guys <laughs>
so there you have it guys you can achieve amazing footage with a budget gimbal bought from aliexpress it only took about a week or like 10 days to get to my house and you can have amazing footage with a 30 pound gimbal bought from aliexpress thank you very much for watching guys if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more like this in the future don't forget to subscribe like the video if you loved it. Thank you very much, guys. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.